Hi everyone, I hope we're all doing well. Um, so as you can see, we're in the car, we're gonna uh, head over to Kirsty, Marie and Maeve and we are going to car kick! Yo, 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 yo. Um, as you can see, it's absolutely fucking stunning day out there. So, you know, we're on to a winner. We're staying in Cork, we're going to Kinsale and we're going to Coves. Yeah, here we go. checked in um i'll show you a little tour of the room now in a second but uh we got to cork a couple of hours ago um and we went and got food straight away we went to a place called pink moon, pink moon and they do pink lattes as whopper and um, yeah so we went and got food there straight away because we were starving but the fucking the traffic is so so bad in cork city now i don't know if it's just because it's bank holiday weekend um but yeah it's really 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 bad but yeah we're checked in now uh me even Kirsty are in one room and Maeve and maria are in another room but the check-in is three o'clock we got here at like i think quarter to five their room still wasn't ready, which is a bit fucking weird. Um, and then around half five, they got a call to say that their room was ready and they can check in and all that. But um, yeah, it's just a bit weird. Like, um, but yeah, we went and got a cocktail while we were waiting. Uh, we're gonna go get dinner in a place called Electric. Now it's walk-in, so I don't know if we will get a seat. Um, but yeah, I'll show you a little uh, tour of the room. So we walk in, got two little chairs there double bed single bed Dyson fan little dresser full-length mirror yeah so like the room and all is quite nice um, and it's spacious oh yeah bathroom <laughs> your electric toothbrush is so quiet I know, I was just there. so it's just, I think, the, the staff at reception, well, it was just one lad. It was just a little bit rude, but like, you know, we'll get over it, we're on our holidays. But um, yeah, so we're gonna get ready now. We're gonna go to Electric. Um, they do cocktails as well. So we're gonna get some food and some drinks. And that is the POA for today. next day and uh, yes we went to that place electric for dinner and we got drinks there as well um, and yeah it was fucking class food was really really good they've got vegan non-vegan veggie stuff as well um, and the cocktails are class um, the staff were so fucking cool they were just so so nice and like super attentive is that yeah. the word yeah like 
Um, yeah, and they just kind of went out of their way to make sure we had a good time. Um, and yeah, because like when we actually got there, it, there's not, it's not like a booking place. Yeah, it's just walk-ins. And um, when we got there, there was no seats available, and we just started talking to the bouncer, and she was like telling like telling us to look up different places, and she'd recommend if they were good or whatever um and we were just standing outside for ages looking up places asking her oh is this place decent blah 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 and then uh, like as we were in the middle of doing that a space came free um so we actually just ended up going there anyways but yeah we were sitting outside and they were just like because it wasn't sheltered and they were like look if it rains it rains there's nothing we can do and we were like yeah yeah it's fine it's fine it's only meant to be like a tiny bit of rain at some point but then it started pissing down. But Kirsty brought our brolly, so me and Kirsty were fine. Uh, the fine. Yeah, the, the girls got soaked. But then they were like one of the, like our, our server. He was is that server? No, is that waiter. our waiter? Not our server. Sorry. My our, <laughs> I realised I was like, oh my god, I sound like such a snob. Yeah. Um, but our waiter was like constantly like I'm re I'm trying to find you the table the second one comes free is gonna have it um and then after a while a table did come free so and I was sheltered so it was um yeah it's class so we stayed there till around I'd say maybe 10 half 10 I'm not sure it was just it was such a good first night my voice is quite hoarse it's not too bad but I, I can feel it definitely needs to be rested a bit um but yeah, we were going to be going to Cove today, but we are going to go to Kinsale today instead. And we're going to do like a hike. And yeah, I think there's loads of like vegan and veggie places as well to eat out there. So we'll have options. Um, and then tomorrow we'll go Cove because we want to do the Titanic Museum experience thingy. Um, and that was sold out today. So that's why we're doing Cove tomorrow. But yeah, that's the POA. Peace. These are like little chickpea roll things. We're kind of struggling to find vegan places that we think would be nice. How is it? Oh, is it? Unreal. Yeah, so we got two of those and I got like a little falafel wrap and then we got two little treats. Um, I'll show you them after. So Eve got the, I think it's like a blueberry lemon cheese flake. Of course it's vegan. Oh, taste test. Is it good? Mm. Oh, unreal. Right, I, um, I got the, I think it's like a banoffee type thingy. Let's let that focus. But like it's actually super fucking small. Um, okay, taste test. Ooh, oh, it smells unreal actually. Never had banoffee. So good. Oh, banana. -y. That's quite nice actually. Is it? Mm. Oh, the top bit is really like newsy or something. Yeah. Mm. Barry's place! <laughs> finished at Charles Fort and um, we walked from Kinsale town up there now it's about 
an hour's walk. Yeah, I think it took us about an hour. Yeah, but now it is tough. Like it's it's grand, like it's road, but it's all yeah, uphill yeah. and then down. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Jesus Christ! <laughs> so yeah, yeah it's, like, like, it's all a lot of it's uphill, a lot of it's downhill. So um, what? Very slippy. slippy. Oh look, there it's very grand. Slippy thank there. you. Um. And it's like really, really steep, so um, it's steep. actually very slippy here too. Go. And like today started off as like proper overcast, and now it's like 21 degrees, absolutely scorching out. But um, yeah, the the views along the way are like so, so, so nice, and the fact that it's so sunny out as well, you just have like views of well, I'm not even sure what Can that sail. is. Can sail ocean. Oh, no. <laughs> um, just Kinsale. Just Kinsale, yeah. But then when you get to Charles Fort, that's also really, really cool. Um, and it's massive as well. Yeah. So that's where we're, we're just after coming from now. Sorry, I'm actually really out of breath. Um, but yeah, would definitely recommend it. Um, but Jesus, if it's this warm, definitely bring your sun cream. <laughs> um, and plenty of water. Um, yeah, plenty of water. But yeah, what else? Oh yeah, so we're just gonna, I think we're just gonna head back maybe to the hotel yeah. now. Um, we're all like hitting a massive wall, except for Maeve, Maeve is full of beans. Um, so yeah, I might actually have a little cheeky nap as well before we go out 100%. for dinner later on, just cause oh, I didn't sleep that well last night. Also, look at this. My friend Claire made this. <laughs> and one side it has Jeff, because people in work call me Jeff. And then another side has like Disco Witch. Um, yeah, actually, uh, we're taking, we're coming back now, but we're taking a different route. It's more like scenic and definitely fucking easier. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's um, but yeah, I think the most important part now is that it's definitely a much easier walk. Uh, but yeah, I'll check in later. Bye. <laughs> Hello everyone, so we are getting ready for our dinner, we are going to an Asian restaurant, it's called Koto, Koto. Um, and yeah we've booked it for quarter to nine, that was like the, one of the last bookings they had, um, and it's literally what, like a ten minute walk, yeah. ten, something like that, yeah. Uh, yeah, we got back from Kinsale and literally just had a shower. And then I was getting into bed and I was like, right, I'll go for a nap, but I just couldn't sleep. So then I went down to the, and joined the girls in the bar and had a bevy. Yes, this is the same dress that I wore in my Brave vlog. Um, so it's from a shop called Isolated Heroes. And these are my new vegan ducks. Yeah, they they were my, my birthday present, but then I got size too big, so I had to return them. And then I wanted to go in and tried them on in real life and so I only actually got them there on the during the week but yeah and also I don't my hair so it's like pink at the top actually well that's roots uh, it's pink at the top and then it goes into orange but it's uh, it's greasy now so that's why it's tied up but uh yeah that's it We are going to Cove today. Um, we're gonna do the Titanic museum thingy. Um, but yeah, we went and got breakfast this morning, so we got a vegan French toast in a place called Liberty Grill. Um, and then we went and got a coffee in a place called Eco Coffee? Eco Coffee? Eco Cafe. A um, little rough around the edges, <laughs> but the coffee is really nice um and yeah so that's where we're at now and um, we're gonna go meet the girls and just make our way to cove and yeah take it from there
were in Cove and we walked to, uh, about, I think, 36, 37 minutes to go to the best beach in Cove. <laughs> and uh, it's horrendous <laughs> um, so now we're leaving um because we were like right fuck it we'll get into the water but it's actually quite cold today and sunday was meant to be the warmer day oh here comes a car and uh like there's literally no paths or anything like that uh it's just one of those horrible country roads hold on car coming yeah so like you have to walk on one of those country roads to get to the beach and then the beach is fucking shite and there's nothing there uh, yeah definitely would not recommend to a friend um so yeah now we're just walking back the 30 fucking six minutes that it took to get here yeah that was great great sunday great way to waste time here comes the car bye and now i am yours <laughs> <laughs> yeah would I recommend Cove like it's hard to know because all we did was the Titanic experience which is actually really good Um, I definitely recommend that yes yeah, so we wanted to do Spike Island as well but that was sold out so I feel like if we had have had tickets for that it would have been like a different experience for us there's a little vintage market thingy it's indoors well it's a shop but there's different vendors in it, if that makes sense. Oh, there's a hole in... Oh! oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> oh! How did that happen? I think... We're going to go for a, a beverage. <gasps> what did you do? Um, yeah, we're going to go for dinner later at a place called Uncle Pete's. Um, yeah, but we're not going to go for another, like, I don't know, four hours? Three, four hours, so mm -hmm. yeah, may as well just go for a little cheeky beverage. That's it. Bye. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, oh damn, girl. Okay, let's go eat. How happy are you right now? Crying. Crying. <laughs> the poor girl has only had a scone today. Well, like. No, she had, she had French toast for her brekkie, but uh, yeah, she had a scone. <laughs> they don't do bookings. Uh, when we got there, it was like completely full. Um, and now we're after walking back and it's empty. Woo! That's a manifestation, baby. <laughs> yeah. Hello, friends. So it's our final day in Cork. Um, and we're just getting ready now and we're probably gonna check out soon but because the room wasn't ready for like two and a half hours um, after we were meant to check in or when we arrived um, we're just gonna take our time checking out because fuck that like to not have a room ready until like half five in the evening is a bit fucking mad but um, yeah we're gonna have a little look and see if any of the vintage shops are open and and um, we want to go to a market, I think it's called Marina Market, because the English market is closed on Sundays and bank holidays. So, but there's, um, the other market seems good because it has like a vegan stall called Vegan Co. Yeah. yeah. So, we're just gonna stroll around because we didn't really get to stroll around much of Cork City, just like when we'd be going and getting food. Um, so yeah, that's the plan for today. Yeah, so 
so we just got back um i have unpacked already yeah so today we went to a market called marina market because the english market was closed but um yeah there's there's loads and loads and loads of different food stalls there so we went to vegan vegan co um and they do loads of different like kebabs and stuff like that and burgers um so i got i think i got a mixed meat kebab Oh no, my battery's dying. Oh. Um, yeah, so I got a mix me kebab. Like, mix me. Um, but yeah, really good place to get some food. And there's like indoor and outdoor. Um, and both have seating as well. Would I recommend Cork? Yes, absolutely. But, um, like, I don't think you can just stay in Cork City. I think, like, because obviously we did Kinsale and we did Cove. Um, so it is good to have it as like a base because a lot of different places are like 30 40 minutes away so it's not too bad sorry um my my battery died so uh yeah one of the things we wanted to do today was go vintage shopping we didn't really have time because we spent so long trying to look for a place for breakfast but majority of places aren't taking bookings so it's just kind of walk in but then there's no time limit Either they'll just turn you away if there's nothing there or there was just massive queues and then, so we just said fuck it we'll go to the market Now we wanted to go to the market anyways but we were thinking of going there for lunch but by the time we actually got there it was like I think maybe half twelve one. So it was pretty much lunch time and anyways um, Yeah so we didn't get to go and do any of the vintage shops Now I'm not sure if they would have been open anyways just because of the bank holiday But, but yeah that's pretty much my Cork vlog um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit that like button, that subscribe button, and come below. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm kind of hoping I, to do more stuff like this anyways. So, yeah, stay tuned. Peace.